right now I'm in Marshalls before I hit the Nike outlet, man. Just going through the shoes. These New Balance uh, 1400 is cool. Um, you got some Jordans for $40. Um, sometimes I be finding shoes in here for like ten dollars, man. But they'd be, you know, what I'm saying, big size game. New money joints. Um, what are these Reeboks? Oh, you got some Telerios, man. But I think they want too much for me at forty-five. And they got another colorway, the blue joints. These are cool. They're going for forty-five as well. Yo, I like these black and gum bottom Reeboks classics, man. These are definitely classics, man. Bring back memories. They're hitting for forty dollars though. Size are them. Ten and a half. They're cool. Found another pair, size 13, 32 dollars. BYW joints. Um, what size are these? Another third. They're eleven and a half, going for thirty-two dollars. They don't say, um, Woo. What's poppin' homie? This is your boy Frank Nitty back in the building, y'all. Just left Marshall's, bought a couple sweaters, bought a couple shoes. Um, anyways, I'm kind of running late for the Nike outlet. It's pretty much like a three minute walk, maybe a minute and a half drive, man. So you about to pull up there, um, ASAP Rocky. Gotta return those LeBrons, which I don't want, the tomb joints. I'm looking for my car. But anyways, yeah, that's what we about to do. And I uh, still got 30% off, so I gotta definitely use it. We'll see if I use it at this spot. I haven't been to this spot to kind of scope it out to see what's in the, in the building. But anyways, man, I'll see y'all at the outlet. All right, peace. Yo, it's one thing that I hate is when I pull up to a spot on time, I decide to do something else, and then I'm late to that spot I should have been at at the time I think I should have been there. But anyways, man, um, not much people come to this outlet as frequent as I do. Um, I don't even think people, I, I, I don't even, I, I mean, I, I'm here stuttering this joint and, and I don't wanna curse, but as much as people vlog in Orlando, as much as people do Nike outlet vlogs, I think I probably record this outlet more than any other person that's in my area, man. And if I talk, talk to people, they're like, yeah, it's too far for me. Now, to be fair, it's far for me, but I play ball on this side of town, so it's easy to pull up right after after the ball, you know what I'm saying? So I think I'm probably the only one that's vlogged this spot or probably go here. So the chances of me going here and people beating me to the spot, you know, potentially if they have any items that I would want to buy, is very slim. I'm not saying it's not possible, but it's slim in the sense that not much people visit this outlet. So I'm hoping for the best, man. I'm hoping for the best. Anyways, man. All right, enough talking, man. We're gonna we, we're pulling up here, man. I'm talking to give you a a kind of a time frame. That's a stop sign, lady. Thank you. Give me a time frame how long it takes me to get there. And I'm literally 20 seconds. Gotta stop at this stop sign. And I told y'all it's like a minute and a half. Cause right now I'm rambling. I'm talking for about a minute and 32 seconds. And I'm here, y'all. I'm here now. I gotta find a spot. Is this spot right up front? Yes, it is. Taking these joints back. These are LeBron tunes. Don't need them. You can come through. All right, you're welcome. Ooh, it's nice and warm in the building. Oh, what's, <laughs> what's good? What's good? What's good? All right, pulled up. Somebody recognized me. I guess uh, this spot is not as secret as I think it is. I'm walking through the aisles. Um, walking through the aisles. Walking through the aisles. We're up in this corner. Damn. So we got cleared out. I wonder what was here. 120 and it was going for $54. Damn, it's going. It is going. Whatever it was, it is going. 64. Got some slides, some slides, some cleats. Cleats, 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 cleats. Uh, that's affordable. All right, look at the hash wall right now. Indy still Westbrooks. I'm not even in the right box. 130 though, man. Let's take a closer look at this damn shoe. Ah. At least the rest Brooks, what, like the 2.5s? Maybe the 3.0s? Who knows? I did notice a lot of them have that little earth and heart. They got a strap. Oh, they had a strap to it now. Signature logo at the bottom of the tongue. That's a clear strap. It's light, though. It's, low, it's light, like a mid-top. It's cool. They're going for retail gang. 130. Why not 3.0 size 12, my size. Not an original box. Um, these are going for one. Oh, this one for 90. Our pass though, man. Spray my ankle on these, so x -day on those. Um, I don't see anything. Of course, I got a drop of shoe. These are going for 50. 
And um, these are PGs. No, they look like some PGs, but they're probably not Air Versatile 2s. That's the first time I ever dropped a pair of shoes twice. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, 720 joint. Some more basketball. Those are going for 50 though. 50, 34. Um, are these the Alphas? No, they're not. These are the Ritz TB basketball, team basketball. Um, some more Ritz, uh, some KDs, some Paul George though, going for 70s, the team basketball, P PGs, like the, what's it, the threes, yeah, the threes. Seven dollars not a bad price, multiple sizes. Then they got another set right here, I don't know what colorway this is. Oh, this is the black joint, the pepper, the salt and pepper joint. All right, let's put this back. Flip it around, okay. They got the South Beast LeBrons, because I was talking about like, yo, what that SB stands for, but they're the South Beast. These are the 16s. Few sizes left, 11 and a half, actually my size. Well, actually, they got two rows, so okay. So they still got a good amount of different sizes. Some witness, hard pass on those, for me at least. Maybe for y'all, y'all might like it. The lows, the Kyrie lows for 80. You got more Kyries, but these are fly trap joints. Both going for 50. $4, multiple different sizes. Now we got the half ball, man. I'm giving y'all the wide angle because maybe y'all might see some stuff that I don't. Y'all know how I'm bad at uh, combing through shoes. I may not find. I talk about every pair that's on the aisle, that's in front of me. But y'all be like, yo, Frank, you missed this. Yo, one of the craziest shoes that somebody mentioned is that, they say I missed the Thunder Fours, bro. It was a shoe that looked like a four, but it really wasn't a four, so they got thrown off real bad. Imagine if it really was a th Thunder Four, I would have clearly missed it and I would have lucked out. KDs, more 720s. Look at these joints, hard pass on whatever they are though. What is this? PG4s, oh, okay, okay, let's take a look. I have not seen a PG4 in person. I know they got the zipper on them. I saw the Gatorade joints, and these are not the Gatorade joint. Definitely give them a try. I don't need no basketball no time soon. No basketball shoes, that is. But uh, the PGs are definitely affordable shoes, so I could foresee myself buying a pair. They're 110 for this. No additional discounts other than the friends and family that you already have in your inbox. If you're a Nike Plus member, hard pass on these, like I told y'all. I actually have two pairs. I might be selling my player I play ball in, and also the pair that I have that stock. What are these? 270 Reacts. They're cool. Ah, uh, yes, KDs. Size 11. Throw. I about to say throwback. <laughs> Team basketball, $80 for those. A um, whole bunch of elements, 55s for 90 though. Like I said, I'm keeping it rolling so y'all can see shoes that I may already miss. Like for example, these, uh, these are the denim sixes. These are already on sale, bro. You can definitely get them for a great, great price, man. They're already on sale. I think I saw them as for like 150. But anyways, man, we'll go through the aisles and we'll come back and finish the hash wall. What are these? These are the one slash nineties, right? Yep, and they're going for 80 size 10. Go down this aisle, see so got some slides, a whole bunch of slides. I got that pair of slides, I got that pair of slides, more slides. Yo, this whole aisle is slides. This is the first time I saw an aisle dedicated to slides, yeah. Literally, no talk, real talk. Except they got one shoe. It's an SB, but it's going for 50. Our pass though. Let's flip it around. 40 for those, more Janowski's. Here's span twos. I right, like this colorway, that's cool. Ooh, the 87s now. This is a, not, this is not the colorway I own, but this is the actual element I own. The 87s, very comfortable. I can't front, man. I bought a pair, I took it to England. That's all I rock when I was overseas. Very comfortable shoe. 120, um, this is the 55s. I don't own the 55, I haven't really tried them on, but if they're anything like the 87s, they're gonna be very comfortable. That colorway is cool. Not fancy about that colorway. And the 2Ks I heard is also a very good, comfortable shoe. Um, the Zoom 2K, $44 for it. All right, spin the corner on this side. What we have, some Burrows, be it Burrows Lows. Our pass on these Hirachi Edge for 40. Not a bad price, but I hate that shoe. $50 for those. What else do they have? That's some more 2K. That's the Crimson colorway. This is the all black colorway for 40. Like I said, I heard good things. A lot of people told me that they had some tech in them, Zoom, and um, they're very comfortable. Now this shoe is very nostalgia looking. Uh, Air Max, they're going for 80. Multiple sizes, multiple sizes. Uh, I'll flip it over here. Uh, Air Max Sequence for 70. Uh, what is this? Air Max Motions 2 for 60. Air Max More Motions, More Motions. And what are these? Uh, Occultus, I guess that's how you pronounce it. I don't know, maybe y'all can help me out. Uh, they got multiple sizes in these, and these are here for 34. Different colorway of the same shoe, 34 for it, 34 for this colorway as well. I'll see some LeBron 17s, more than an athlete. They're going for 200 though, size eight and a half. Oh, I like this, I like this, 90 though. Somebody clown me and say, stop saying shadows. They're not shadows, they're shattered. My fault, guy. Of all the things you can clown me on, 
is the fact that I keep calling these. So my apologies, man. I wrote him a, <laughs> I just see the comment. I left him. But anyways, man, these shattered backboard Mars R270s are hitting for $8, right? Yeah. You can use it 30% and get a lot cheaper. If y'all care for that shoe, though. Uh, phone posit two joints. Uh, I don't even know the price on this one. It's kind of scribbled out. What else? What else? What else? What else? Let me take a, a stance back. Y'all see anything that y'all like? Y'all see anything that I'm missing? I'm um, combing through. Hopefully, I don't get copyright and I don't have to keep jump cutting my clips just to edit out the music. So, I'm trying to talk over it as much as possible so I can continue showing you guys what's in the aisle without me jump cutting my video because Nike playing their music real loud and YouTube is trying to demonetize my videos for copyright music. Uh, anyways, these are eight, eight and a half. These are the Gore Tex joints. Cool. Um, $200. The price is not cool though. It's kind of hefty, man. Patent leather 270s, right? Yep, 109. Uh, that's shoe of the weekend. Some outlets, bro. What's this down here? This is some SBs, 50 for those. This is a different colorway. 110 for that. The PG. Those these twos? No, they're threes for one. They can't be three. Yeah, maybe they are threes. I'm tripping. And what about these, man? These are the Bowfins, right? Yep, Air Max 270 Bowfins. 160 is the price. They're kind of steep for some Bowfins, man. Kind of steepy. Right. What's these uh technos? They're going for 50. But those hasn't changed much. I still like this Harachi joint. I like that all purple. And look how many prices. <laughs> uh stickers they got on them. They're going for 54 now. Alright, man. Let's keep keep it moving. Let's go through the aisles. Uh this 270 React is going for $670. Let's see what colorway this one is. Um, ooh, it's a pretty looking color. Very uh Miami-ish colorway. You got this uh black and gray right amphasite. Now it's called blue voodoo. Oh no. Blue Void. Yo, that's crazy. That, oh, wait, 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 wait. Blue Void? I look at the shoe I just looked at. Yo, why is it Blue Void? There's nothing blue about this shoe. Oh, this is Black Bass Gray. Okay, okay. This is Black Bass Gray. That's probably for that shoe. More 270 Reacts. And this is the black colorway. Air Max flies for 40. More Air Max 200. Colorway school. Could be, uh, be true Air Max 200s though. Um, black joints. And then you got the Army Fatigue. Uh, tailwinds for uh, fours SB for 90 multiple sizes there flip it around you got the varsity or university red for 99 a lot of these Air Max ones are still struggling they deplete they replenish they deplete them again they replenish and the price is $54 so the price is not that bad but they must got a crazy amount of them or they're not they're not selling as quickly it's probably like a slow burn Ooh, look at the price 70 for this Air Max 95s I like and then you got the bread of temples, which is getting very scarce. Look how empty this aisle is, man. It's getting very scarce, man. It's might hit the hash wall soon. 80 for these, not a bad price. I like the colorway. And what's over here? Air Force 270s for 99. This price relapsed so much. Maybe in different outlets, I have seen it for cheaper. But over here, they got them for 100. Multiple sizes there. All right, man. So there's a wrap just left the Nike outlet in Winter Garden, man. Um, I combed through all those aisles. I really didn't see anything I want. Some shoes I thought was gonna be here, like those Cortez, uh, Stranger Things, uh, even those Nike, uh, I think what they call AW something. Uh, they're like Nike uh, Air Force Lows, they're black joints. I'll put them up on the screen. I thought these was gonna be there because they had a full size run. Um, yeah, it really wasn't much, man. It really wasn't much that I could could have purchased and take advantage of that 30% off. So. Uh, I'm gonna haul on to my 30%. Oh, and I tried return those, the bronze, but apparently they would have to give me a gift card. And uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. I'll just hold on to the shoes until I know for a fact. Or I'll probably ship them off, because I think if you ship them off, get your money back. But nevertheless, Mikey, Mikey's gonna get their money from me anyways. However, however I spend it, whether I buy something on my, my credit card, or if I buy something with cash, or even I decide to take those back and take the um, gift card they're gonna get the money right back so um at the moment i don't need anything so why hold on to these so if i go to a spot and i see something i want i'll just even exchange you know what i mean take those give them those and let me see what's that those anyways i'm sorry i got something that came through on twitter i was trying to see what shoes that were they were but that's it man that's all that's all for winter garden man hopefully i get this video up asap rocky so you guys can see what's in the winter garden outlet and see uh if it's worth coming through and, and and making a purchase um outside of that man if you're new to this channel you like my content you like what you just saw and you want to continue to support your boy just come back and watch my videos man but if you want to get notified when i drop a video you got to hit that 
subscribe button hit that notification bell as well everyone everyone else man leave your comments down below i'm trying to get back to those comments as soon as possible there's a lot of them so i apologize man but anyways man your boys out of here man see you on the next video peace